I got you. All right, so uh, you know, walking your way out the castle, link in Going hand, back. boomerang, and it's okay. <laughs> and I'm Linkle. <laughs> Lincoln Zelda. <laughs> she is the maid. Okay, so uh, you hop on out of the sanctuary. That's where you wind up if you take the path out of the castle, if I'm not mistaken. And yep. um, it, in order to progress to the first dungeon, you actually have to uh, head over to a little famous town. Uh, a lot of autographs being signed there uh, in the Zelda universe. It's Kakariko. Is it Kak Kakariko or Kakariko? What do you guys say? I say, I say Kakariko. Kakariko. Anybody that says Kakariko, I think, is a sociopath. Oh. Kakariko. Justified. Yeah. Got it. <laughs> <laughs> we just sharpen my knife right here. Uh, so, <laughs> um, a lot to see, a lot to do in this town. Uh, what have you guys done and seen in Kakariko Village? My time in Kakariko Village. I hit a chicken, <laughs> bought a, a, a glass jar, found an old woman. <laughs> She she called the cops. <laughs> I talked to this woman and she said, "Help! Help! Get out of my house!" I said, "I have a weapon. What are you gonna do? You're just an old lady. Give me that. Give me that net. I'm gonna catch some bugs with it. Let me go blow up the shed." <laughs> Yeah, you're basically uh, wanted for arson at the end of this. You're just blowing up houses with bombs. Um, there's a lot of cool stuff to find here. And it's just a lot of cool character stuff in there. Like, uh, you know, bug catcher net guy. Just guys in their house just chilling. There's the, the brothers. I mean, that's technically south, but it's still it's still kind of the thing. But like, like the brothers that are fighting with each other. There's a lot of cool little character moments in there that, you know, Probably weren't in other games at the time. It would become kind of a staple later, but yeah, a lot of life there. A lot of life in this little village. Yeah, I think there's like even it's it's even relevant as the game progresses. It's not like a stagnant place, even though from the start you can get two bottles, you know, so that's super helpful. And, you know, in conjunction with the net, you get fairies, you put them in bottles, you could, you know, stock up and, you know, kind of progress through the game kind of easily that way. But, uh, I, I do think that there's like a couple opportunities to get some other stuff here too, like heart pieces. There's an entrance to the Lost Woods in the back. And uh, I, I think it's it's just kind of memorable. Yeah, that's oh, all right. The memories. Which Kakariko Village tune do you prefer? This one or the one in Zelda Ocarina of Time? Ocarina. I don't remember, I don't remember any of them. Is that what it sounds like? Oh my god. <laughs> I can't hit those highs. <laughs> they were like, should we like should we like hire somebody to orchestrate this music? And Mibo's like, I'm just gonna whistle it. Yeah, he's he's like, let's hire this uh <laughs> this uh teenager. <laughs> yeah, he's got a recorder. <laughs> he's, he's got, got a harmonica. <laughs> <laughs> That's a harmonica? Yeah. 